Yo, New York Yankees fans, yet again, it is Felix from NYNews.com. Like always, a local mustache. Yet again, let's talk about my Dominican brother out there, Luis Castillo of the Cincinnati Reds. If you've been following my channel for quite some time now, and if you've been knowing about NYNews.com for over 15 plus years now, you have seen that I am a huge fan of a Luis Castillo. I've been pushing for the Yankees to trade for this guy for about two years now. And it's being confirmed that the Yankees have had interest for Luis Castillo for about two seasons now, as the top Major League Baseball writers have come out and said, or have stated that the Yankees have attempted in the past to trade for Luis Castillo. But here's something interesting to add. All the Spanish reporters that have credibility, like Hector Gomez and a few people from Venezuela, Dominican Republic, are stating that this deal might get done, and the centerpieces to this deal on the Yankee side might be, or will be, Miguel Andujar and Clint Frazier. Obviously, a few other names are going to be included. Is Luis Castillo worth, let's say, let's say, is he worth Miguel Andujar and Clint Frazier? In my opinion, he is, because Luis Castillo on any Major League Baseball team would be the premier ace of that staff but as we all know Gary Cole being the Yankees number one ace number one starter Luis Castillo would be the perfect number two and don't tell me the Yankees don't need to make a trade for Luis Castillo they got Corey Kluber Corey Kluber is coming off is going to come off a rebound season where in my opinion at this point of his career is a number three or I go as far as saying that he could be a number four Hey, it sounds crazy, but you can't tell me that in the competitive market, Corey Kluber is going to be the same Kluber that we saw in Cleveland. He's Yes, he's going to be legit, but he's not going to be the old Corey Kluber that you were used to seeing. Hey, in my opinion, and I can speak for the majority of Yankees fans, it was a great pickup, but the Yankees need a real number two behind Garrett Cole. Are we forgetting about Luis Severino? No, we're not. He's going to come off Tommy John. Luis Severino has been, you know, up and down in his career. Obviously, he has ace potential, ace stuff. Some people call him an ace. But Luis Castillo is 100% healthy. And like I stated previously, he could be a number one on any Major League Baseball team. So like I said, all these Spanish commentators that know people in the Spanish-speaking circles when it comes to Major League Baseball and the higher-ups are saying that this deal might get done and it's almost maybe a certainty that the centerpieces that are going to Cincinnati, these two names that are being brought up are Miguel Andujar and Clint Frazier. And again, I will state that this is not 100% confirmed, but the people that are putting out this information have credibility like I said, when it comes to the Spanish-speaking community in Major League Baseball. And again, I will add that the Yankees have been in love with Luis Castillo for quite some time now, like I stated. And, you know, they tried to trade for Francisco Lindor, but the money wasn't there for the Yankees. Luis Castillo just got about $4 million plus in arbitration, and he's going to fit the budget that the Yankees are operating within. So, so don't put it past the Yankees to not make a trade like this. If the Yankees are going to go big, expect a blockbuster in the, the lines of the Yankees acquiring a picture like Luis Castillo or La, Luis Castillo himself. So, Yankees fans, like always, leave your opinions in the comment section below. This is the NYYNews.com YouTube channel, 4,000 subscribers and climbing. And we couldn't be more thankful as this channel is a commentary channel. We don't take footage of baseball games or highlights. We don't take the easy route. So we want to thank everybody out there for being subscribed to this channel. Like always, this has been Felix from NYNews.com. Share, like, and subscribe, and I will check you on next time. Before it hits the front page, NY